And now it's time for Reading is Magic. Our book today is an award-winning book by the second grade students of White Bluffs Elementary in Richland, Washington. They won this award from Scholastic Books and it's about their classroom pet, Houdini, who is a hamster. Let's think about that for a second. This was their classroom pet, so everybody cared for it. Pet, P-E-T. And this is a picture of some of my pets. This is Penny, and this is Tigger. They're both cats and loved them very, very, very much. So, let's read about the classroom pet, Houdini. All of the pictures here are illustrated by the children, too. It's dedicated to all classroom pets, great and small, who teach us responsibility, compassion, and unconditional love. This is a picture of their school. So let's start. Houdini. Houdini was our class pet in room 221 at White Bluffs Elementary. She was a puffball of orange and cream fur, except on her ears, which were speckled hairless saucers. Saucer, that's what you put a cup in. There are her ears. It says, hi, I am Houdini. I love to eat. The only thing small about her was her stubby little tail that was as bald as a plain hot dog. Here's her tail. Warning, this hamster tail is naked. Oh my. She escaped too many times to count. And when not on the run, she loved stuffing her cheeks with anything valuable, especially carrots. Hamsters have pouches in their cheeks where they can store food. And this is interesting. She escaped to get away. Houdini is the name of a famous escape artist. So that's why they named her Houdini. Houdini died today. But here's the deal. We are choosing to be happy. And this is why. Houdini was more than just a classroom pet. She was our superhero. She could scale the sides of her cage, leap off a three-drawer file cabinet, and zip down 24 steps in the blink of an eye. It says Miss Connor's Classroom. She was an escape artist a master at forcing the lid off her ball and unlocking any hinge made by mankind. She was a spy, a sneaky night crawler that had a secret spy room in every corner cabinet in each classroom. It says, do not enter hamster spy room. She was an athlete, shooting down the halls as fast as a bullet and able to do pull-ups with one paw from the top of her cage. She was a silly clown, climbing the rails of her cage like a monkey in the circus while wearing a funny costume. She was an expert eater, eagerly munching carrots, lettuce, peas, corn, or sunflower seeds every waking moment. But 
But most importantly, she was a member of our classroom family. Her innocent looks, sweet little squeaks, and twitchy long whiskers warmed our hearts each and every day. It says, I love Christmas. <laughs> As you can see, that little creature was more than a classroom pet. She was family. Houdini taught us to never give up, to eat our vegetables, and to love unconditionally. As a wise person once said, don't cry that it's over. Be happy that it happened. Thank you, Houdini, for happening. Aw, look how cute she is. Here's a picture of their classroom. Let's see if we can find something else about pets. What's in our magic bag today? Oh. Look at it, it's a stone. It's a stone shaped like a heart. A heart. A heart means love. H E A R T. Heart. See you next time. <laughs>